Welcome to Blind Owl Outdoors. Uh, I just wanted to talk about one little thing. I'm sitting out here in my screened in room, away from all the mosquitoes. It's sprinkling outside. We're in the Philippines. Uh, we had about almost five inches of rain last night. Everything's all wet. Haven't seen the sun for a uh, better part of a week now. But I was watching a video made by the barbecue pit boys i don't know if you've ever seen their stuff before but i've only seen one of their videos it was called potato bombs 101 and the barbecue pit boys is bbq pit boys i think it's dot com and just search for potato bomb on the uh on youtube and you i'm sure you'll come right across it but pretty interesting way to cook potatoes uh, I would have demonstrated how to cook them but I I can't get any of the ingredients here except for potatoes and what what they do is they take a potato wash it and then they take an apple corer and core a hole through the potato and then they save that they save the cores then they take uh, sliced up ham and turkey and uh, pieces of cheese and some sausage, different types of things, and they put a put a plug on one end of the hole, half of a half of, of a potato plug in there. Then they jam the whole center up with with the with the ingredients, with again with the sliced ham and the shaved turkey and all that stuff, cheese and and uh, <laughs> different things. Really, really looks good. And then they put a plug on the other side and then they wrap it up in aluminum foil and cook it on a barbecue grill at uh, they recommend about 375 which will be with the lid on for about an hour and 15 minutes and about halfway through the cooking roll the potatoes over and then when you get them out obviously unwrap them and then cut them down lengthwise and put them all out on a plate put some sour cream in the center of them and then let everybody pick and choose because they're you know they're all they're all basically different unless you cook them all the same or put the same ingredients in them but the, the ones they had were all mixed up different ingredients But it really, really looked good. Uh, it made me so hungry I couldn't hardly take it. Because uh, where I'm at here in the Philippines, there's absolutely nowhere on my entire island I'm on to go buy anything like sliced turkey or sliced ham. Or uh, you can't even buy cheese on this island. So it's it's uh, <laughs> it's a different world here. Let me tell you. But take a look at their video. I think you really like it. It looks like a fun uh, thing for a picnic or something like that. But I guess that's about all I have for you right now. Thanks for watching.